dear fans, to another episode of Ask a Monkeyologist with me, Dr. Kauf von Diefendorf. Today, what? I'm trying to get the new invention to work. What does it do? It interprets dreams. It listens to your dreams, then interprets the dreams. He's off his meds again. First question comes from my fan. Dear Herr Dr. Kauf von Diefendorf. First of all, would you kindly deliver her, Professor Momlish Bosch Blablash, my most heartfelt welcomes to our dimension? No. Now then, I do have a question for the both of you. A question of severe importance, one that wars have been fought over with no faction ever being able to claim supremacy. The question is, what's better, Team Fortress 2 or Overwatch? Well, I, I like Counter-Strike. But I like Team Fortress 2 too, too. So, uh, I don't know. Team Fortress 2 too is modern. What's so modern about Team Fortress 2? Now, Overwatch, that's where it's at. But if I had to pick between the two, I'd choose Awesome Nuts. What is Awesome Nuts? Only cool kids know. Why would I expect you to be as cool as us hip youngsters? The only thing hip about you is your hip replacement. You promised? I to tell anyone about that. Well, I did. Next question. I'll take this one, you good for nothing yeti. Thunderfang asks. Thunderfang asks, dear doctors, why does this channel not get more views than Captain Sparkles? He has a good point, Carl. Why don't you make more Minecraft videos? Minecraft is a scientific blasphemy. The physics in that game makes no sense. How? How? Can you have a block standing me there? Oh, I bet you're gonna say that the graphics are bad too. Graphics, graphics, it's all about science here. How can you combine sand with gunpowder and obtain dynamite? And lots of imagination which you seem to lack, Carl. I can't expect you to appreciate the finer details of Minecraft. Now, Mr. Th Thunderfang, you don't promise any Minecraft videos in the future, but we do expect to overpass everybody on this site, so stay tuned. Next question. My uh, fan asks dear Herr Dr. Kauf von Diefendorf, what's your darkest fetish? Well, what is your darkest fetish, Kauf? Dear my uh, fan, every human being has his own desires and secret wishes. That is perfectly normal. However, this information is classified. Next question. Grabber one says, here's my question to both. <laughs> what did you do? Nothing. Grabber one asks, here's my question. Oh, finally. Test, is this working? Gustav, what are you doing? Bothering your show. Check this out. Last night, I dreamt I flew over Mount Rushmore and when I looked down, I dropped my pipe. You are deeply concerned for the well-being of the children in Africa. Ha! It works! Cow, want to give it a shot? This is really stupid. Afraid of my genius, I see. No, I'm not! Machine, listen to my dream. There I was, skipping along the banks of the Amazon River. I was going and going and suddenly I see in the distance a big ball of spaghetti. It looks so tasty. I started running towards it, but no matter how much I ran, I could never taste the tasty spaghetti. You are deeply concerned that you will never be as awesome as Professor Gustav von Schneider. See, it works. That sounds just like you. See, I knew it was stupid. Grab everyone, here's my question to both of you. Last time I dreamt about weird things. They were confusing me in my daily routine. Every time when I had a moment of silence, I heard the chicken. What can I do to avoid this? Well, but you can well, let's do. check it out. I'm gonna feed the question of gravel one to the machine and... You are highly intelligent and you should seek acceptance into Harvard University. That sounds more like a fortune teller. Yes, I can tell I'll make a fortune with this. Graver one, you must... Oh wait, there's another dream. 
Dear doctor, since a few weeks I've always had the same dream. I am standing in a valley, there is nothing around me but trees. Then I begin to hear voices and weird noises. Some sounds like well-known animals, some others like freaky zombies. They came very close, but when I looked around, there was absolutely nothing. What can I do to avoid this dream? You watch too many zombie movies. Your unconscious is telling you to watch better shows, like... My Little Pony, Friendship is Magic. Watch it, watch it now, now, now. Gotta work on the advertisement part. But when it will be fixed, you'll bring me millions! It's gonna make millions of people going to therapy! Now Graver One, it is not as simple as you may think. You see, if 10 people dream of oranges, for each and every one of them it will mean something different. You see, it all depends on what the elements of the dream mean to you, what special meaning they have personally. Therefore, you see, uh, Carl Jung, Carl Gustav Jung, Carl G. Jung once said that dreams are like... Next question. Um, there it is. As, as the Pini asks, Dear Carl and Gustav, I have a question for each of you. What is blue has three legs and flies under the water? A beautiful blue Chernobyl pigeon. I had two in my laboratory. Very kind creatures. One ate the other. What is yellow? Has five legs and swims under the clouds? One of my failed experiments. His name was Frank. He's no longer with us. Oh, you killed it? What? No, he's in Hawaii. What happened to the remaining pigeon? Haven't you heard? What? It's flying under the water. Well, fair enough. Thank you, dear fans, for writing your questions and sharing the answers with your friends. Write your new questions in the comment section below. Subscribe, 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 subscribe. I'm starting to like this thing. Me too. Do you think it can translate stupid to smart? No, but it can turn any comment into a question. Now ah, we're gonna be rich. I built with so many flaws. Would you rather pass the butter? Never mind. That's what I thought.